still to come today, Evil Adam up to his old tricks again mm, yes. in Emmerdale. But could the good doctor be about to get his comeuppance? Richard Shelton, after the news. <laughs> yeah. uh, that, that murder scene, actually, the, 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 the terrorist murder scene, that, yeah. you said that was hilarious. It was wonderful. I mean, I've got to say, out of Emmerdale is a wonderful place to work. It's full of great people. It's a family. You know, everybody says this, and it is. It's, it's fun, and, and there are very refreshingly few egos, you know. Everyone gets on with everyone else. But Nick Brimble is just the most exquisite actor. He's, his face is so, you know, frightening time. one minute, and then full of laughter the next. Mm. And Lorraine and, and myself and Nick really hit it off. Richard Shelton, ladies and gentlemen. Now, the evil, the, e the evil Adam Forsyth. the one. <laughs> now, of course, that's how you guys know him, but I know him better as uh, Neil Diamond singing You Don't Bring Me Flowers with uh, Claire Sweeney on Celebrity Stars in Their Eyes. That was a, oh, yes. a weekend against my, my Renee and Renato as Vanessa <laughs> Phelps. Probably best left there as a, as a memory. Um, but you're not primarily here to talk about Emmerdale, in actual fact, because Richard's just released uh, this, uh, his debut album, Top Cat. <laughs> And for those that don't know, that's kind of was one of your big breaks, isn't it? You were Frank Sinatra impersonator. Or, well, or, uh, impersonator, is that the right word? In the Rat Pack? Actor. No, we, we did a play called Rat Pack Confidential, which was a Nottingham Playhouse initiative. And it, uh, the, the play was um, based on the book uh, by Sean Levy. Mm -hmm. So it exposed the reality of those men, you know, their lives, you know, the mafia connections, the womanizing, the alcoholism, the political maneuvering. And you got to see Sinatra at his most malevolent, bad, um, spiteful <laughs> self. You know, You're which scaring was... me. <laughs> John is in for... Which one of you is Frank Sinatra? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, go, go Good casting. That looked like, like a being great deal all. of fun, was it? It was oh. wonderful fun, wasn't it? It was yes, tremendous. Great. How long does it take you all? A day. A yeah, day. A, a day. cold Plus dance day. Lessons. And thank you for doing it. I oh, think it was you were a pleasure. fantastic. It was great fun. It's 20 to 8. Now, when dishy doctor Adam Forsyth joined Emmerdale, no one expected that he'd fall for loopy murderess Steph, let alone ask her to marry him. But it turns out the doctor's got a few skeletons in his own cupboard, and Richard Shelton, who plays Dr Forsyth, joins us now. <laughs> you. You're a dodgy geezer as well, then. They're all dodgy. They're all dodgy in the Dales, <laughs> aren't they? <laughs> oh, they've all got their secrets. It is it? a very big storyline, isn't it, this yeah. one for you? It is. It's great. It's, it's wonderful to have had time to build up this character, this rather charming doctor who's there for Steph with all her problems. And, you know, um, she's beguiled him, you know, and he's slowly by slowly fallen in love with her. But uh, what he hasn't told her is that he's got a secret of his own. Our favourite faces from Emmerdale, the Royal and Hollyoaks might be from rival shows, but tonight they're all working together to raise money for the Motor Neurone Disease Association. Ring-a-ding-ding. -ding. On screen their characters may cause havoc with their fighting and cheating ways, but on stage, well, they're a real charitable bunch. Aww. And the most charitable of them all is, believe it or not, Dr Death himself. Yes, Emmerdale's Richard Shelton. The last time we saw him, he had ended his days in jail, but tonight he's resurrected and he's the host and organiser of the whole event. Dr. Death, you're alive! I'm alive, live and well. <laughs> <laughs> now, tell us, it's the second year running you've organised this event. I mean, are you mad? <laughs> oh, I, I think it, in the run up to it, it felt like I was perhaps a bit crazy, but you know, last year we uh, performed it with the whole cast of Emmerdale and we wanted to do repeat a charity big band swing light again. But this time we've we've made it bigger and, and got this wonderful talent from the Royal and Hollyoaks and Jane McDonald and opened it right up. See, I'm not really a, a murderer or a nasty person. I just I just ask people with a smile and they say yes.